Welcome to the Fulton High School announcements for Wednesday, February 17th. I'm Cassie Vaughn, and at this time, could we please have a moment of silence? Now please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please make sure that you are not wearing hats, knit caps, and hoods in classrooms and hallways. The Young Writers Institute will be held on Saturday, February 27th, sponsored by the University of Tennessee. This day of workshop is free and held virtually this year. Learn about creative writing, including poetry, dialogue, young adult fiction, and more. See any English teacher for help signing up. There is big news from the library. The library is no longer charging fines for overdue books, so return those long lost overdue books and check out a new one. Seniors, please check your Class of 2021 Canvas page for new scholarship opportunities that have recently been posted. They are also listed on Fulton's website. Tutoring is available for all students in the library Mondays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays from 3.30 to 5, and on Wednesdays from 2 to 3.15. Teachers from all core subjects and TRIO staff will be available to help you with work. The Fulton Fellowship of Christian Athletes Club meets in the team room in the gym every Thursday morning at 7.45. All students are welcome to attend. Do not forget that you must wear a mask at school, in classroom, and in the hallways. Make sure your mask covers your mouth and nose. This week's College Spotlight is on Fisk University, a HBCU located in Nashville. Fisk is the oldest university in Nashville and offers more than 20 undergraduate and graduate programs. Fisk has over 30 clubs and organizations and offers 13 different sports. As a part of our semi-spirit week, you can dress up in your favorite team's jersey on Friday. If you do not dress up, you must be in dress code. Our next basketball home game comes up on Friday night when the Falcons open the district tournament. The girls host Scott County at 5 and the boys face off with Alcoa at 8. Have a great day.